This is Gigabyte on the BEN Network, where we show you how the tools of tomorrow are affecting businesses and jobs today. I'm Kristen Korsiak. It's safe to say that our lives have been radically changed by smartphones. The focus of that change now is on apps. Consider WhatsApp. It's a messaging app that takes advantage of data plans and Wi-Fi. It's hugely popular among travelers looking to avoid SMS and roaming fees when they're abroad. But new users of the messaging app are in many ways even more exciting. In India, for example, it's become a convenient way for vendors to reach their customers. Humble vegetable sellers, previously confined to small local markets, can now snap a picture of their produce and send it to customers who then get a chance to see what's an offer at the snap of their fingers. New avenues of promotion are opening up what would have been unthinkable even five years ago. It's high tech meets emerging economy. Nitlin Janin of Now Floats, a startup dedicated to getting small businesses discovered, says WhatsApp is a formal channel for communication and not just a casual messenger anymore. People have then taken a piece of technology and made it their own. And it's empowering businesses, consumers, and even governments. Police in Delhi, India, have even begun using it as a formal method for recording complaints. Some might wonder why WhatsApp is preferred to more widespread media like Facebook or even email. The answer is in the app's all-in-one package and its seamless functionality. Users can do everything in one place. There are limits, however. As it stands, vendors can only send out messages to groups of a maximum of 100 users. And then there's a gray area in the app's terms of service, which states it's not for marketing. Nevertheless, people are using the app creatively and it's having a huge impact on the emerging economies. We might think of it like other proven ideas that have been a success in India, such as microcredit financing as a form of micro-marketing. But even if it's now relatively small, the change it's capable of producing is huge. I'm Kristen Korsiak. Thank you for watching Gigabyte on the BEN Network, where jobs come first.